Hello everybody and welcome back to my channel Today I am trying two new products um, One of them unfortunately got spilled But it's fine So I'm still gonna use it because I really 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 want to try it out. I've heard amazing, amazing, amazing things about it. So today I am using Camille Rose Curl Love Moisture Milk with the Camille Rose Curl Maker. I am so excited to try these. I am pretty sure they go together. Layer Curl Maker on top of the Moisture Milk. So these two go together and yeah, let's get started I am just going to brush my hair forward like I always do so I'm gonna move my towel to here all right so I'm going to gently do this like I always do so I am going to start with my hair primer first and I'm using the Bumble and Bumble hairdressers invisible oil heat UV protective primer I'm just going to spray this first. So a little bit about this product. It comes sealed, but I opened the seal. So make sure if you ever buy this that it comes sealed. So let's try this. Ooh, it's not that heavy. It is lighter than the... Um, can to curl activator definitely so this is the texture it's very creamy and smooth and I will rub it in my hands and start applying ooh that's a very interesting scent it smells like candy wow very strange. I don't know if I hate it or I love it. I'll get a bit more. Now I'm going to grab the curl maker. So this is the texture. And this is to get a better view. It's a little bit sticky, so I think that's good. Let's just put this on my hair. I'm so excited! This one also smells a little bit strange. It's weird. Don't know. Don't know how to describe it. So just take it always as a rule, I will always brush my hair after each single product I ever apply. I think that's a much better way. So now for my styling, I have many Denman brushes, but for today I'm going to use the... I think this is the D14. If I'm wrong, I am just will correct myself down here. But this is so cute and small. I used to love this when my hair was shorter, but now um, I still love it, actually. I really do. Some days I find myself reaching for it, so still like it. I'm gonna do what I always do, which is just 90 degrees angle and brush up. You know, there is construction at the building right in front of me and there are workers here since too early in the morning and they stay till like 5 and they drill and they knock. I mean, they're construction workers, you know, but they're so close. I swear to God, they see me like they see everything. They're just getting the tutorial before you guys. It's a little bit creepy in my opinion 
and it's noisy because I can't film except like this late in the day which is very 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 annoying for me because I lose so much daylight this way it's such a shame all right and I am just gonna go diffuse and come back really 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 quickly all right boo boos I am back I have a cast on I just Grabbing any oil I have. Again, this is the Husk Argan Oil from Morocco. And I'm just getting one dot because that's all I really need. And I'm just gonna scrunch my cast out. It's not really, I don't think it has like fully, fully super dried yet, but I have no daylight left. So I gotta do this quick. And as always, I will move my roots. Wow. Wow, wow, wow. You know what? I'm actually not gonna play a lot with it because I want the last like 10% to dry before I take apart the curls, but this is beautiful. Look at this. This is so nice. This is gorgeous. Wow. Girl, I am so happy. Oh my God. You know what? When it fully dries, like the last 10%, I am going to post a picture on Instagram so you guys can see like the full situation. You can always go follow me on Instagram. But anyways, I just want to talk to you about these products a little bit. Now, I've already spoken about this. All these products, I got them from lookfantastic.ae, which honestly, after today, I cannot recommend that you buy from them anymore because... <sighs> it's just too much of a risk that your products will actually come damaged. As I told you, this product's built and it has a break over here on the bottle, which I don't super appreciate. So I am going to find another bottle that I can pour this into, but I was so excited to finally try it. So I decided to keep it for now. Um, this does worry me though, so I will definitely find another bottle that I can put this into but yes everything here is from look fantastic i personally do not recommend using them i am going to stop using them it's just not worth it for me anymore if you want to order from there that's up to you you know i just really had to have my hands on camille rose like i was i did not want to order but i really 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 wanted the curl maker because when i got this the curl maker was not on the website, but then I saw it on the website and I was like, ooh, but I want it and I got it and yeah, it was, the order was just so damaged. It's unbelievable. Like I have one of the products completely emptied, but anyways, I am so happy with this. This is so nice. This is gorgeous. So I'm just going to take you closer to this. But yeah, it's so cute, I love this. And the Denman brush, you know, I don't know where you can find the goddamn Denman brush. All right, so I just wanna talk to you a little bit about these products. Uh, so this is the Camille Rose Curl Love Moisture Milk, rice, milk and macadamia oil, a softening leave-in conditioning cream with light notes of macadamia nut and vanilla. I don't know what macadamia, Macadamia nuts and vanilla, it smelled like candy, like actual candy. It was very strange. But, um. Da -da 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 -da. This does contain glycerin, but it's further down on the list. But, you know, this list, you would never know if it's true or not. But I think that this is coconut free, because I know some, I have a friend actually who's allergic to coconut. But I'm pretty sure that this 
it's glycerin free. Oh yeah, this is glycerin free. So, yep. If you, this is gonna be good during humidity because it has no glycerin at all, not even any hints of it. But yeah, this is the results. Thank you guys so much for watching. Uh, if you have liked this video, if you wanna see more, please do like, comment, and subscribe. I appreciate it all. Thank you, bye-bye. You know what? I almost forgot about this, but I remembered, so it counts as something. Um, so I'm, I do a little thing called um, last thing that has nothing to do with hair, or in Arabic, آخر شيء مرصاح في الشعر. This just started one day randomly where I wanted to complain about a mascara. So I just say random stuff that I really love or I really hate. Uh, for this month, it's just going to be positive stuff of stuff I really love and it's all about chips as I told you in the previous video but this video I'm gonna talk about this this is one of my favorite chips and it's the Tyrell sea salt and black and black pepper looks like this I love this it's so good and it's like you get a lot it's uh, for like 11 reals Saudi reals I think I'm not sure but I find this uh, I live in Bahrain of course so I find this in Lulu or in Usra and I think it's a little bit more expensive in Usra I think it's uh, for uh, 13 uh, Saudi Riyals but I love this this is one of my favorites for me and my husband and um, yeah so don't forget I just remembered and I refilmed again Anyways, uh, bye bye.